Hi everyone, this is Remarkables by Margaret Peterson Haddix. It is a mystery that has a dose of supernatural in it. So um, it's about 11 year old Marin. She is new in town. She's just moved there with her family, her parents and her new baby brother. Um, they are, parents are really tired. <laughs> they have a new baby in the house and um, she has no friends and the friends she left behind, she left with some drama, which we don't really know what happens. So she goes off on her own to kind of explore her new neighborhood. And she climbs this tree in the woods behind her house and she can kind of peek over and see into her neighbor's yard. And she sees all of these teenagers lounging and hanging out. And then before her eyes, they disappear. Like they were never there. It's not just that they run and hide, just poof. And so she thinks she's going crazy at first. And she's like, what am I seeing? One minute they were laughing, having fun. And the next minute they're gone, like magic. So um, she can't believe her eyes. And she wants to know who are these people? Can anyone else see them and what makes them so happy why are they laughing like that that's not how it was with Marin and her friends um so she's lonely in town and she wants to kind of she's eager to figure out more and she meets Charlie her other neighbor and he lets slip that he also sees them and he calls them the remarkables for their what his theory is their ability to travel through time so he thinks they're real people that are um, coming through time to the present age that's a theory we don't really know what they are. But Charlie does warn her to stay away from the Remarkables and him. He wants nothing to do with Marin. And so you'd soon realize that both Charlie and Marin have a painful secret that they're holding on to. And they both, for some reason, think that if they can solve the mystery of the Remarkables, it might help them both. You have to read to find out who and what the Remarkables are and what both Charlie and, um, and Marin are, are holding on to and hiding. So um, this is on our summer reading list, so hope you read it and let me know what you think.